Shine a light. That's it. Ah, oh, fantastic. Co-written with Ed Sheeran in the single, was uh, it? Yeah, it's true, yeah. How did that come about? We were, uh, I was playing in Dublin and he was on a Friday and he was playing on a Saturday. So I went along to his show and, and we met up and sort of stayed in touch. And, and just clicked? Yeah. Does it, does it sort of make it, in a way, more interesting to work with someone else? Sure. Just the bouncing uh, of ideas? Yeah, you never know what's going to... I mean, I had the idea sort of parked for a while. It was... Uh, I was working in New York for the last couple of years, uh, putting together a musical. Of and, course, the Pretty Women one. Yeah, yeah. And, and all the while sort of um, putting ideas together. But the thing was, last last summer, uh, both my parents went into hospital right. at the same time, and I thought I was going to lose both of them. Yeah. I lost my dad, and I was trying to think of ideas, really, that was, how, what can you say um, that would be sort of uh, an uplifting sort of tribute to your to your parents. And so I thought Shine and Light was the, was the idea. But do you know what's interesting? You're an amazing photographer. We talked Thank about you. your, your photos before. But you took this off you took this off yourself. Yeah. Yeah. How'd you do that? Well set it up and just <laughs> there's a lot of listen, there's a lot of mistakes before you get to that one. Right, uh, okay. Yeah. Well it works beautifully. Thank you. It's really good. I like it's a very, very striking image. Well, now not only is Ed Sheeran on there, JLo. Yeah, I did. How did that happen? That's a good one. Email again. Is uh, it? Yeah. Just email people. I well, just email anybody. Hi, JLo, do you fancy yeah. doing this? And no, I, says, yeah, I, had, uh, I emailed her manager and said, because the song is called That's How Strong Our Love Is. Uh -huh. And I, I wanted to write, I wanted, I it actually completed the song. And then I thought, hmm, it would be nice if I had a real woman singing with me this on this, you know. Mm -hmm. And I've sung with a few good women in my Mel life. Mel C, of course, and, and big hit with Tina her. Tina Turner. Yeah, and, and Tina Turner, well, yeah. Um, really. And so I really wanted to um, see if I could get her, and I, and I wrote to her and she loved the song and uh, she's on it. Brilliant. Yeah. It works fantastic. And I just found out that it's in the top 10 of Spotify songs already. Does that still mean all these years that you've been doing it, is it still an absolute thrill and a joy? Totally. When, when that happens, or, yeah, yes, you, still, you still get a real kick out of that. Yes, very much. In fact, got a... Uh, uh, it was kind of deja vu coming back here in the BBC this morning because this building, I mean, we came into this building yes. back in the 80s uh, for Top of the Pops. Of course, this is the top of, if these the, walls could talk. I, I mean, the beans on toast that I ate in this <laughs> path, honestly. <laughs> I know, I know, because it's the old iconic BBC building, of course. It is, it is. yeah. You talked about Pretty Women, which of course you co-wrote, the musical. Yeah. It's coming over here. It's coming in 2020, Sweet. yeah. So, yeah, that's been an exciting... That'll be good. Exciting episode. Exactly. You know, and you've got a big milestone at the end of the year in November. Oh, Lorraine. Listen, I'm only mentioning Millstone. it. Look, I'm only I'm only mentioning it because we both turned sixty in November. Shall we have, as you like, collaborations? Oh, yes. Shall we have a joint you're party? Not, you're not sixty. I am indeed. November the thirtieth. Come on, girl. You join the Look third how club. beautiful. It's an exclusive club. Wow. That's got two of us in it, Amazing. and I'm sure there'll be more people. We yeah. should have a, we should have a joint party. Yeah, I'm, I'm doing a Mexican party. Are you? What, tequila and everything? Well, See how I just they'll, went they'll, to they'll, they'll, You went will to music, be, I went to booze. There will, be, <laughs> there's, there will be some, yeah, for you, if you drinkers. But, uh, you know, Mexican food and... Brilliant. Yeah. Oh, that would be fantastic. Mariachi band. Mariachi band. The best. It's so much fun. That might be your next album. I, I, it might be your next single. You could do, you could do a collaboration Somehow, with the Mariachi I, I band. I don't, don't <laughs> think so, Lorraine. <laughs> no, this is... Do you know what this is, Brian? It's class. Thank you, love. It's sheer class. Thank it you really so much. is. I'm going, so to say, I'm going to say good luck with it, but already it's. Well, doing yeah. So well. I, I, thank you. I'm, I'll, I'll take all the luck I can get, you know. <laughs> and we'll meet up for tequila on our birthdays, well, on our joint great. November 60th birthdays. I can't believe you're going to be 60. That's <laughs> I can't great. believe you are. It's ridiculous. Look at you. In your prime. In your prime. <laughs> Brian, thank you. It's always Thanks. a joy. Great to be back in Britain. And I, I know. great want to thank all my fans for the tour we did this the last couple of weeks. Of course. It's been so much fun. Thanks, to everybody. Good.